This is still Miss Aries and welcome back to my life vlog. So today, I'm gonna talk about how I motivate myself to work and in relation to that, I'm gonna show you uh, my work bag and you know what's inside of it. If it's something that you can relate to or if you have some tips, we can probably you know share a trick or two. And so if you are interested to know about those things, please keep on watching. So today, yun nga, um, how do I motivate myself to work? So especially now that we're working from home, it's kind of a challenge to bring yourself to work. So no una, syempre, the first few months that we're all in lockdown and we're just working from home, it's very convenient because you don't have to commute, especially in the Philippines. It's a challenge. It's really challenging to commute every day, especially if you're comparing it to other countries. If you have been out of the country, you'd see how um, I'd say we're behind in terms of our public transportation. But again, I think, uh, like I always do, I digress. But in that, so initially working from home is not such a bad thing, right? So you get to work at the comfort of your home. Kung gusto kong lagutom ka or you just, you know, wanna get some fresh air, you can, you know, easily do so. Just walk, uh, walk outside, you know, get some fresh air. And that's it. Pero, you know, as the months progress, I find myself kind of more tired than, you know, than, than the times that I am actually going to the office to work. So, to be honest, prior to this, I am actually not a, fa uh, not a fan of working from home, maybe because I live alone. And for me, the human interaction element of my day comes from working. So, I found, you know, I try to find ways for myself to still be motivated as if, like, you know, I'm working from home, I mean, normally, like, like before, before the, I mean, pre-lockdown or pre-pandemic. So, what I did was, ako, I, I, I know, I'm not sure if you've seen all other videos that I have, but I'm really such a fan of a lot of things and one of that is fashion. And so, and then, one of the reasons siguro na nag-enjoy ako um, going to work or going to the office is I really like dressing up or matching things, tops, bottoms, and dresses. My sneakers, I, I love that. Wearing makeup and all. And so, sabi ko sa sarili ko, why do I not just do that the same way sa, you know, work from home setup? And so today, I'm gonna show you what's in my work bag. Maybe you're thinking, bakit, an, an, bakit ako magkakaroon ng work bag? Eh, eh, nga, nasa work from home lang ako. So I just imagine, like, parang when I go to my home office, dala ko pa rin tong work bag na to. And... I imagine that I go to work and nasa tabi ko talaga siya like if I need something um nandito talaga siya sa work bank ko and hahanapin ko talaga siya from here. So today I'm going to quickly show you uh what's in my work bag. So first let's let me take out my work bag or show you my work bag. Bag or show you my work bag. So okay, na cover niya na halos yung camera and then this. So, ito yung work bag. Sinasabi ko. So, this is a Kenzo uh, Flying Tiger work bag if I got it correctly. So, this is a big work bag. As you can see, the reason or parang actually na kaya ko siya nahanap is because I was looking for a bag na an office bag that would fit a 16-inch MacBook. Kaya ganito siya kalaki. So, prior or maybe before we go to, you know, what's inside the bag, I also included in the title that this could potentially be a do for a, uh, a potential do of a Christian Dior book note. So, why did I say that? Una una, if you, you know, go to the website or if you check out the dimensions for the Christian Dior book note, the book tote that originally came out, kasi ngayon may iba't ibang sizes na, if you compare it to this, Actually, sobrang katiting lang ng difference nila in size. So, parang like, this is 42 centimeters and then si Christian book to, Christian do, si Christian your book to ay nasa 41.5. So, something like that. In terms of like, the width or yung lapad niya. And, ayun. So, this this is one of the reason or that's one of the reason that I got attracted to 
Christmas bag as well. Parang somehow I found an alternative for the Christian Dior book code. So last time I checked, around 2,600 pounds na yung Christian Dior book code. So I guess that's around 200,000 pesos right now. I'm not sure if my conversion skills and my math is going to be right. Pero ganun. Ganun na yung amount no Christian Dior book code. So there is no way that I will buy that bag for that amount as well as I don't have the guts for it. And so I'm gonna start showing you what's in my work bag. So again, this is kind of like a role play. Di ba parang nung bata ka, you play dress up or you play like yung teacher teacheran. So parang ganun na lang din yung iniisip ko na parang I get to still like use my bags or things pero the truth is, nandun lang talaga kami sa, or nandun lang talaga ako sa office, um, home office ko. So, what's in my work bag? So, first off, I mentioned na um, I bought this bag or I was able to find this bag because I was looking for totes na kasha yung 16-inch uh, MacBook. So, right now, ayun. So, yun, syempre, yung pinakalaman niya is my laptop. So, this is the case. And then, um, of course, my pencil case. So this is from Mango. And yun nga, actually, yung mga gantong pencil case na Mango, sobrang tibay din. And actually, nakasigil siya sa Zalora, kaya I like it. So inside this, well, I have my yun, ink velvet um, lip tint. Sobrang love ko to. I think this is she good brick or red brick ng Perry Pera. And another thing, I think during the pandemic, this is parang pinakamarami yung mga pang-discover is sobrang seal, lagi nag-seal yung mga brand. So yan, meron akong highlighters. Ang damto highlighters, so hindi ko alam kung bakit ko kailangan. I also have like a cheap, a, a cheap tint from the face shop. So parang favorite group kong dalawa to. Like we go, we quick um, zoom meetings ako na ayaw ko na kong effort na mag-makeup. I just put on this cheap tint chick tint and lip tint. And then, ito, almost just stable. <laughs> puro siya, ano? Puro siya. I don't have the financial cap uh, capacity for it yet. So, I was so happy that I found this book. Highlighters, and maybe later on, you're, you're gonna know why. Medyo kalat-kalat talaga yung mga gamit ko uh, inside my bag. So, okay. Next item is this Moleskine Note. So this Moleskine notebook, this is actually not like uh, an office thing. Tagang personal notebook ko siya for anything like maybe random computations that I like to make, computations like budget, grocery, or things that I'd like to buy. So yung mga goals ko, ganyan, yung ako nilalagay. Like vlog ideas, I put them here as well. So ayun, sale na naman po, Moleskine, if you happen to visit a uh, Brad Pack in green belt sometimes they give you know big uh, discounts for this and actually i used to really like writing a lot and sometimes i still try to do so and it's good to have this notebook or journal journal with me all the time and then the next item is this febrela na super uh, ano to, micro umbrella Sobrang liit lang nito. I bought this in Shopee. To be honest, I'm not sure if this is like an original umbrella. But so far, I think I've had this for a year. And, and then, of course, my ID. Yes, I still, you know, I still bring my my ID with me. Um, or lagi, lagi lang siya nasa pag ko. So, just to add to that, you know, imaginary element or role-playing element that I still am working at the office. So, yun, my ID, company ID. And next thing here is my uh, uh, Tangle Teaser. Um, next one is this. So, this one is uh, a Garapata, Garapata uh, mask. So, I bought this from Basic Movement sa uh, Instagram. So, they're like uh, a reseller of art stuff. Tama ba yun? Or art merch. So, the Garapata, you know, this this iconic logo or art um, or character is by Dex Fernandez. 
and so he sells his items through basic movement. So I bought them from them. I bought one because it's a for me price is about 400, 500 yata siya when I first. And then next, this. Ah, okay. So this next one is perfume. Um, ano ba siya? Iti ba siya? Well, it's a fra fragrance mist. So asam ko na lang na hindi siya iti or iti since there's nothing really. Um, that there's there's nothing that indicates that here. So this is from the body shop. Um, white mask ng the body shop. So the reason I bought this was that this is, I believe, the perfume or the fragrance given by um, Goblin to his Goblin, right? That's a key drama, diba? Goblin, the Lonely God. And so, ayun. Kaya ko siya gusto. I think this is, you know, this has, this needs no introduction. Si Heart Evangelist na rin yata ginagamit to. Pero, yeah. So this is super mura sa Japan. Bought it. So this is like just you know a touch a, a very good touch of powder because it is used to be white sha. And then speaking of powder, I also have my uh, oil sheets. But then even yes, even working from home, I still use this. Especially if na aircon kayo, mas madalas kayo or mas madali kayo mag oil up. So I still have this. Wala akong pa kaya tumingin lao na wina. I just do it for myself. Eh. So, ito siya. Pakadami po. Uh, I just realized, pakadami po pa lang naman ng imaginary work pa. Anyway, next up is the body spray. I just realized, wala rin yung alcohol ko dito sa bag ko because I have it on sa office table ko. And then, I also have this um, minto. Alam ko minto, latong something to or roto. Roto something. Eye drops. So, whichever, kung ano yung maging talagang tamang pangalan niya. Pero again, I guess this is already popular online. So, I use this even if I don't wear contacts. Like, if feeling ko pagod na yung mata ko from, from work. Aside from like resting my eyes for a few minutes, I put on this. Or I put this on my eyes. And then next, what else? Ah, uh, this is an empty roller ball of, uh, of fragrance from from Miniso. Um, next, I have Burt's Bees Vitamin E and Peppermint. Of course, if um, parang kahit anong panahon ng taon, like anong weather, I have chap lips, so I keep this one all the time. Next would be another lip product. This is Love Your Lips, like a color butter from a happy skin. I think this is part of um, Kathleen's first line sa happy skin if I'm not mistaken. Pero, like for example, if I don't have um, first beats with me, ito yung secondary option ko. May mint siya, so okay. Meron siyang konting, yeah, meron siyang color. Diyan, ganyan lang yung gray niya. So, it's as if like very natural lang. And next here is nakikita nyo na, is a big skin. So I have lots of these, like among all my bags. Like I have the poison uh, inhaler as well. So ito yung isa ko pa, like the Vicks inhaler. So yeah, nagkalat siya yan. Tita, tita needs. So yun. Ito ba yung tita? So of course, lip products. I have this from... I have this from Clio, Club Clio, na lipstick. So, hindi ko na alam kung ano shade niya. Pero medyo coral siya. Ayan, yan yung kulay. So, very, ano lang siya. Eh, pag, and, uh, when I put this on, kasi dami na lang. Ganun lang, very light lang. Para lang magkakulay yung lips. So, ito. Ito yung nandito. And another thing to pair with it. If you notice, kapag meron akong chin-in, meron din ako parang chin-in na same, same, ano, same, um, color or tone. Ito. So, yan. Yeah, yun, ito naman chin-in. Pwede rin lip nito, pero I tend to use this more for the cheeks na. Kanina pala hindi ko siya natch. Ayan, makikita nyo na parang-parang 
kung ano yung magka-partner ni Chief and Chief Lynn. Medyo mag-care pa rin sa natin. Parang cohesive tayo yung sura natin. So, lagay ang kajina. Dahil pangarap ko ka, <laughs> pangarap ko mag-swatch-swatch sa iyo. Ayan. So, yan yung mga pinagawa. And then, going back to here, ayan, meron ko pala ang isa. This one, this is like, siguro if I have time to choose and if I have a few ko, ito siguro sa my favorite, I think number one. This is a Vida Orange, Silky Orange Beach. Haba na pangarap, pero yes, Silky Orange Beach. So, this is my second, um, nagpa-bottle na to. I actually left the first one sa bag yung sa, I mean, ano to, it's a place to. Nakalimutan ko na, pero yun, yung place, basta naiwan ko siya sa isang pizza restaurant sa Padlo. And, ayun. So, I asked, sobrang favorite ko siya. Nagbumili ako agad ng kapalit. So, ito siya. And, iyo, swatch niya. I just said, yun, sas, magkaka, pari mo lang para siya. And, sa camera. Pero, caps. And then, the last item here, is yung kikin ko, is this hand cream. So, Kanina na-mention ko, di ba, na lagi akong may alcohol dun sa bahay. And, syempre, yung alcohol, nakakatry siya ng kamay. I'm not sure kung mga Pinoy ay big fan ng hand creams, pero ako, parang dahil kakanood ko ng mga what's in my bag ng mga Korean vloggers, lifestyle vloggers, I started using hand creams as well. Especially if you, you know, work sa household chores and you wash your hands with like soap and detergent, nakakatry din yun hands and this is one way to uh, you know take care of your hands and not to mention this is EP so I bought this in Japan last year beginning and who would have thought that sa mga ikaw lang siya gagamitin so that's that so yun yung laman ng PA kit ko um, what else ang nabili sa bag actually dito sa loob ng bag wala na pero tingin natin yung laman and mukhang meron na siya Okay, looking at the, ito, itong second pocket dito. Alo kami yung paulitan. This one is from L'Oreal. And this is the shade. Ay! So, ito naman, sobrang ipin. And again, mukha ko tanga kasi parang, ito ko nag-register sa, ano, sa screen yung kulay niya. Pero yan. And then, next up, ito. Ito pala. So, ano yung nasa pencil case ko? Diba? Meron ako puro highlighter. Pero nakita nyo naman. Sa so, journal ko, meron ako yung ipit na barbe. Yan, sa pockets, meron ako yung ipit na barbe. So, this is just a typical gel pen. And then, I also have this notebook. So, this notebook from Artwork. And, I've seen my I have seen some past videos ko ay mag-age fan ko kayo yung kasama. So, ito, this is a notebook set for from artwork. And then, next would be this Sunny. So, makita nyo na lang sobrang patron ko ako na Sunny. So, I have this eyeglass with me. So, recently, I moved to Bulacan. I moved back to my hometown here in Bulacan. And so, I'm anticipating that when I go back, to work sa office since I work in Metro Manila I'm gonna go and I work the graveyard ship and so pag uwi ko I'm pretty much one of them and so I always have an eyeglasses with me so I love this design so this has been with me for almost 2 years 2 or 3 years na and so pero yun and yun and so so um very um standard black trim brown tinted na eyeglasses and then, meron pa ba? Meron pa tayong laman. And then, this is the last thing. Pangit ko yung sura. Not so proud and away na sa isang ito. So, naka-plastic lang siya. Kasi, these are disposable masks. Parang, which is Louis Vuitton inspired na mask. So, my mom bought me this. She found this in the market. And then, the market. Meron pang iba. Like, maybe Chiba and all. Pero, I want this design kasi black and white siya. I asked her to buy me some more of these because it's super cute and I'm definitely and the 
natin kung finally ayun, well, eto, last na it's just like a clear card and so parang ganun ka pa rin siya parang just in case lang if I want to like sell the bag or something ano yun siya, yung clear card but that's it I think for my bag like for my imaginary work bag wala na siya wala na siyang laman and yeah, that's really just how I clients and you know, they work with me so I um, you know I'm trying to make sure I get to the mindset mindset as much as possible aside from you know this special trick that I have I always also make sure that I take a bath I you know prep myself I you know change clothes I don't wear parang pantulog clothes lang what I do is I still wear like since ako uh, I work for a company that requires me to still groom myself because I'm on video most of the time when I, you know, meet with clients and people within the company. I still wear like you know office tops, like blouses and all. So that those those little things, you know, gets me to the to that mindset. At the end of the day, it's really up to you on how you would motivate yourself. So as long as you're able to deliver and do what's expected of you at work, I think you're doing a pretty good job. And again, just reviving the past year and still getting up every day is an achievement. So, you know, pat yourself on the back for that. And that's pretty much it. That's really just what I want to share. And so, I hope, you know, the content that I showed you today is pretty relatable. And if you have any suggestions, questions, or comments for me for my next videos, please feel free to drop me down your thoughts below on the comment section. Again, if you have, you know, if you just want to talk, you can always, always leave me a comment and I'll try my, my best to answer back. And that's it for me today. That's a wrap. Thank you so much for watching and see you on my next one.